Any questions anyone has? Say. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. There is confusion saying that all major decisions for one year, the destiny of people, is decided on the night of Al-Qadr and not on the 15th of Shaban. Can you clarify this matter? Okay. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. For us Tariqat people, following Tasawuf, following Shaykh, it doesn't matter which night it is. Does it matter? No, it doesn't matter. Why we have to wait until one night in a year to worship to Allah, to ask for forgiveness? Are we going to say now, oh, I made a mistake. I worship on 15th of Shabbat instead of Lelah to Qadr. Oh, are we? <laughs> we don't care. <laughs> because like they say in Turkish, every night, think that every night is Qadr. And every person it is? Hizr alayhi salam. Meaning every night is a night of power. And every person it is holy and Allah has hidden something there for that person. That that person may be uh, one who is going to help you, save you. So, anyway, for I don't, I don't know Arabic so much. Maybe my Arabic brothers, they can help me. But Qadir is different. Qadr is power, the night of power. It's called the night of power because the Quran was revealed on that night. Because the power is reaching. Now this is uh, Shaban, uh, mid Shaban. It is Qadir. Qadir is destiny. Destiny and power, they're different, right? They say. Or different words? Say, say. Qadar and Qadir, yeah. Like that. They, they speak from here. Yeah. But Qadar and Qadir, they are different. So, but to us, we don't care so much. Whether we are going to worship, asking Allah to change our destiny on the 27th, or on the 15th of Shaban, or on the 1st of Muharram, or on Ashura, or every day you should be doing it. Say, Ya Rabbi, please forgive me for all my sins and make my tomorrow, my next year to be good. That's what we should be praying. So it really doesn't matter. Those ones, uh, it's not as if you pray on that day, but because uh, you didn't pray on the latter letter to Qadr, uh, for Nisfu Shaban, Barat, Allah is going to say, Oh, wrong time. <laughs> Cancel. <laughs> No, it is not. So, but like I said before, for our way, we are doing it every night. You have to do it. At least do it once a week on the night of Juma. At least once a week. It's the most holy night. It's holier than the two Eids combined. At least Thursday nights. We are making a zikir. We are saying, forgive us. Make a whole week to be good. So, that's what you can do. So if you're doing it at least once a week or every day you're doing it, then that time you are more than ready for Laylatul Qadr or Laylatul Qadr. Yeah, doesn't matter then that time, right? <laughs> very slow in the uptake today. He worked very hard. Okay, understanding? No, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is going to be still in the first paradises until... The Fajr time. Now, don't think now, we are not Wahhabis to say, oh, that means Allah is coming down. Quran is speaking, Allah has hands, correct? It doesn't mean Allah has this kind of hands. Huh? It says Allah will sit. It doesn't mean Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Jalla Jalala, who Azza wa Jal is going to sit on the chair. When we say Allah is smiling, it doesn't mean Allah has a face that. Quran is saying Allah has a face and Allah is smiling like this. Don't think it is like that. If you do, you have to make one step to understand the language of the prophets and the saints. So, we are not those ones who are stuck with these things. But Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, uh, 
rahmat is raining down. So don't be busy with malayani. Don't be busy with things that don't concern you. You're going to be busy with things that will bring you benefit for us, for this ummat. Ask for the return of the Hilafat. Ask for the return of the Sultan. Ask for the coming of Hazrat Mahdi salam and Hazrat Isa salam to come soon. We are, ya Rabbi, we are tired from this world. We are tired from the zulm that is covering everywhere. Send us your mercy with these ones, Ya Rabbi. Make us to be ready to receive them. Make the prayer like that, at least, inshallah. El Fatiha. Standing? Okay. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Anything else? Anyone has something to say? Any other questions? Cookies? Later, cookies. If there is nothing, I will see you soon, inshallah. Have a good night. Don't sleep so much. We have a long night ahead of us. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.